It's the Woody Show. And it is time for your Friday morning dumbass contest. And today's dumbass contest is the DUIQ. Yeah. Yeah. Too bad. Go ahead and explain the way the DUIQ works. Well, uh, first, we uh, ring a bell really loud, and then <laughs> I go out on the. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's obnoxious. <laughs> then I go out on the street and find a nice drunk person who I ask some nice and easy trivia questions to. Now, you. You play the DUIQ by guessing whether the drunk person will get the answers correct or not. And if you guess correctly twice out of three times, you win. He's got a very high All sensitivity right. to the bell for whatever reason. Well, it's probably right in my face, mm-hmm. and it's a 120 decibels. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm saying, but even when he's not where he's standing today, yeah, yeah. It is. he's necessary. <laughs> saying, he's, well, you know, we can argue that, but it's kind of like Ravy's oversensitive mm-hmm. uh, smell. sense of smell. Yeah. For whatever reason, maybe it's just that uh, pitch. That, yeah, that frequency or whatever. Maybe. Yeah. There is a different show that does like a sports show. They have like a little ding bell that it's way too highly pitched. And I, every time they go yeah, to yeah. it, it's, it's a channel changer. Maybe you got chick ears because uh-huh. like chicks are way more sensitive. <laughs> Look Not it up. Young people. Young people are no. way more sensitive oh, yeah. to high frequencies. No. It's them like, young years you got. Chicks, yeah. <laughs> like they like they were talking about it was an audio engineering uh thing that I was I was reading or watching, I forget what it was. But anyway, they were talking about how uh when depends on who the audience is really for whatever you're mixing down for because women can't handle a lot of like uh treble. So mm. like the more the higher end frequencies they can't tolerate. Also it's irritating. Mm-hmm. So maybe you're a chick. And dogs. Yeah. Eight seven seven forty four Woody. That's eight seven seven forty four Woody. <laughs> End of story. And uh, let's go to our contestant. And say hello to David. Hey, good morning, Hi, David. David. How are David. you? David. Good. How are you guys? Oh, we're doing great. Friday morning. DUIQ. Now, before we get into the questions that matter, we're gonna get to know our drunk a little bit better, so we have a better idea of just how with it or not with it they are. And uh, who is this drunk person, Seabass? This is James. He's out celebrating a big milestone in his life, a big change, and he's doing it in a very special way of his own. James? James. I thought uh, it was Matt. 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 The right guy? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I just wanna, I don't, I'm not in my normal spot, so I don't have my yeah. stuff in front of me. I'm Whatever. sorry. I just want to make sure I have the right guy. It's a guy. He's got a generic name. All right, here's this. Is, <laughs> this is uh, Matt. I'm celebrating because I'm leaving to the motherfucking Air Force in about two weeks. What are you drinking to celebrate, Matt? I had a little bottle, a water bottle of Bacardi, you know? I go wherever I go with that <laughs> Smart move, Matt, because people like, they want to like charge you all this money for drinks, right? They kicked me out last time. Cause What's I, that? Cause I brought my own beer and I opened that <laughs> and I drank it. Oh my God. You got a hot dog in your hand. I got a hot dog, some girl gave it to me, she didn't want it. I said, I want to see you eat it. <laughs> what happened? Oh, and she said, you can eat it, I gotta go. Bye. I took it, you know, free food. All right. Yeah. Uh, free food. You can eat it. I got to go. Let me just say uh, thank you for your service, Matt. Yes. yes. Thank you. <laughs> I go wherever I go. Yeah. I drink it. Just drink it. I don't think people are going to they're gonna, like, uh, trick people by having the clear water bottle with brown Bacardi. Yeah. Right, I know. Right. No one will know what's yeah. going on here. Got to go yeah. vodka or clear Bacardi. Yeah. All right. So, uh, David, that is our friend Matt. He... Uh, is ready for the questions. If you are, you got to get two out of three right, whether he'll get it right or not. Here we go. Question number one. Name any two species of butterfly. Ooh, name me <laughs> two species of butterfly. I can name, uh, I, think, I think I can name one. I know one, yeah. Yeah. There are like 17,000. There's, there's a lot I'm sure there are. Yeah. I'm sure there are. I'm sure there's like names of different hummingbirds yeah, that yeah. Raby's brother could tell us all about. Right, exactly. But it's He's all, obsessed. They're all hummingbirds to me. Oh. I'm going to say no for sure for yeah. Matt. Yeah, I got I'm, a trip no. Yeah, this. you know what? Put me down with Ravi as a trip no. Yeah, I'll trip no. The trifecta that as well. of no. Uh, same with you, Greg? Yeah, trip no. Uh, Menace, do you think that Matt will get it? Uh, no. Uh, what about you, Sammy? No. No. All right, uh, David, yes or no for question number one? I think this is an easy no. All right, easy okay. no. Question number one for the DUIQ Name any two species of butterfly. Menace. Monarch in. Frog butterfly? I know one. there's one that looks like a frog. I don't know if that's what the name of it is, though. Like Monarch's the one that I could think yeah, of. Monarch. Yeah, Monarch. That's the only one I can think of. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, you got one. Unless right. frog is Let a frog me... butterfly I one. Am... Uh, there is a peacock butterfly. Uh, peacock. No frog. No frog. Yeah. All right. Uh, what, Sammy? Oh, wait. In, I put Monarch. Or, yeah, Monarch. And then I also put Moth. On the off chance that falls in the butterfly category. <laughs> <laughs> All things that fly are just, you know. There's a Viceroy. Mo- yeah. It's, it, yeah, moths are not butterflies. No. There's a large white, aka a menace. Large Mars. white. Large white. <laughs> <laughs> Getting. All right. So, uh, all right. Nothing. No point nah, here man. in the room. Let's see if uh, Matt gets it. If he doesn't, 
Could be a first point of the day for our contestant, David, here. Name any two species of butterfly. Well, you know what? I love butterflies. You know, I got ancestors that visit me as butterflies. What? But <laughs> I would be lying to you if I knew what the fuck the species were. Hey, oh, 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 oh. You say ancestors, you mean like people? Yeah, all right, well. That was not dump. edited. <laughs> Sea bass <laughs> again. I don't Classic know. sea bass. Classic sea bass. You have Classic. one job. Yeah. <laughs> to yeah, eliminate the f words. Yeah. Well, oh, clearly he didn't know it. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, there we go. Mm-hmm. You're on the board, David. Congratulations. You got a point here on the DUIQ. Let's sea put editing. Go on. check his work. <laughs> editing on sea bass so, list. You said. You s- you're about to say there was a frog butterfly? No, I thought there was. Oh. But it's just butterflies on frogs. On top of frogs. Oh. <laughs> and and it, was, it was even phrased that said, like, the life cycle of the frog butterfly. And I'm oh, like, wait, Brit. hold on. Everybody I, wait. Yeah. Hold on. Everybody wait now. Everybody wait, wait now. now. Uh, and I'll be honest. Uh, but there's no frog butterfly. I did think about moths. I mean, yeah. You know, because I was like... I, I had the thought, but I'm like, no, nah, I think moths no, are just moths. Their own yeah. category. Yeah, yeah, they're not. Uh, they're not. Butterflies. You know how everybody mm-hmm. loves butterflies because they're so pretty and they're so cute. Mm-hmm. Even though in reality they're disgusting. <laughs> People who love butterflies, are you not grossed out by moths as well? They're disgusting. No, no. I don't see. I don't. Yeah. I don't think they're disgusting. I think Ugh. there's more like they're irritating. They're creepy. Yeah. Like at least butterflies are Big. like they're pretty. Mm-hmm. I like it when yeah. moths like tink off the light. Oh, tink. yeah. <laughs> tink. Oh, you're, you're tink. Too? Greg, when you were a kid, you didn't yeah. have like a butterfly net and no. then have a little right. box to put them in. Uh, no. So, David, you're on the board with one point yes. here on the DUIQ. You need one more in order to uh, win the contest today. Question number two. What sort of company was the focus of the show Mad Men? All right. Uh, let's see. I think hmm. Menace will. Well, I think Menace and Sammy will both get this one. Yeah. I'm going to say no for Matt. So no for Matt. Yes for Menace and Sammy. Ravy. Say yes for Sammy and no for the gents. All right. Uh, Greg Gorey? We are on the same wavelength right now. I'm yeah. saying yes to Sammy, yes to Menace, no, no to, to Matt. Matt. All right. Menace, do you uh, think that Matt's going to know it? No. And now that you've said your answers, I've never seen the show. Neither have I. Neither have I. I know what I know. Like, it's like a pop culture moment. Oh, can, yeah, we okay. start, can we start with Greg then? Because he's never seen it? Yeah. Well, no, I'm just, let, I'm just yeah. saying no that I've never Greg, seen the Greg. show. All right, Sammy? No. You don't think he's going to get it? No, I don't. Uh, what do you think here, David? Yes or no? Will Matt get it right? Uh, I think he's not going to get it right. All right. Okay. Question number two for the DUIQ. What sort of company was the focus of the show Mad Men? Uh, let's see what Menace says first. Oh, okay. Take okay. your guess. I believe it was a marketing company. All right. Uh, Sammy? Advertising agency. Advertising agency. Advertising agency. Yeah. I've never seen it, though. Me, neither have I. How'd you know that, Greg? I. Pff, it's just like That's, I locked into it. It's like that. Dexter, I, those are two shows that are on that been on my watch list yeah. for I don't know a decade. I have not seen <laughs> just like about. you, Menace, a frame of Breaking Bad. Yeah, but I know it's about a dude who starts selling meth. meth. I believe. Yes. How yeah. did I know that? Because uh, you're know. crazy mm. smart. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen a frame of it. Yeah. Wow. All right. Question number two for the DUIQ. What sort of company was the focus of the show Mad Men? Uh, Nick. Uh, uh not Nickelodeon, but. Uh, <laughs> Cars Network. Favorite character on Mad Men? <laughs> Crazy Chicken. Yeah. All right. Wow. All right. David, so stressful. <laughs> Why's coming Price at you? Yeah. 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 All right, David, congratulations, man. Whoa. It's a great phone you got there. It's nice. awesome. I'm gonna, Solid. I'm going to turn that down. Good for the radio. That. And uh, have yourself a great weekend. Thank you for listening <laughs> to The Woody Show. All right. All right there's, uh, there's David, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden, it sounded like one of those like farts that we have. It I know. Yeah. Start yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know. Yeah, the ones that just sound like straight bass. Yeah. Rattling in someone's trunk. Uh, that's a man fart. <laughs> it is. <laughs> All right. Well, we have uh, question number three that uh, David didn't need. We'll see how uh, Menace and Sammy mm-hmm. do. Two hundred and twelve degrees Fahrenheit is what in Celsius? Oh God. Who knows? Double double no. I already forgot, like, how many degrees. What are we 212 degrees 212 Fahrenheit degrees. is what in Celsius? <laughs> what do you know, though? I have a guess. You, you I'll know. guess I'll guess with these guys. Ooh. Okay. All right. All right. Um, <laughs> 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 well, we're guessing, do, uh, we're guessing, does everybody know it? So, Ray, what do you right. think? 
I, I said no, absolutely. Uh, to not. everybody? Not, oh, oh, yes. Oh, okay, oh, great. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm saying no. That came <laughs> to out. Everybody. That came no, out mega three? trips. No. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'll, well, because yeah, you know, my mind was going. Sorry. Yeah. I'm saying. Pa- no. My apologies. That's okay. Um, what do you think, Menace? Sammy, you think he's gonna get it? No. no. Yeah. And I've never seen this before. <laughs> All right, question number three. 212 degrees Fahrenheit is what in Celsius? 212 degrees Fahrenheit is what in Celsius? Sammy? 110. 110. Menace? I put 100. 100? Yeah. Uh, I was going to say 66 degrees. Oh, you should have said 69. Uh, Mm -hmm. If you're just taking stabs in the dark. I know, right? (laughs) You should have said 100 with Menace. 100. Menace lucked into it. Is it really? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Even though he's never seen it. I've never seen (laughs) Celsius. I've never seen Fahrenheit, I guess. Explain to me, so how's 212 become 100? Like, what's the calculation? I couldn't tell you off the top of my head, but the obvious, it's an obvious. It's called being smart. It's Yeah, when you're talking about these sort of questions, (laughs) it's not, hey, do this math in your head. It's, hey, these are reference points. These are reference numbers. It's like zero and 32. Yeah. Right. It's called just knowing it. Um. <laughs> yeah, it's like right, it's like well, five yeah. ninths like, plus yeah. forty. I think it's some kind of. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's, you don't like, have to know that. It's yeah. like pi r squared. Yeah. yeah, it's like being alive. That's and pretty, aware. That's a pretty wild hit to the self esteem right there. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's called breathing. It's called being a scholar. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, question number three for the DUIQ. Two hundred and twelve degrees Fahrenheit is what in Celsius? It's got to be a hundred. Do you think you can survive oh, wow. at that temperature? Son of a bitch. You have to have like some ice with you. Oh, for sure. You know, some shade. But it's doable. Yeah. All right. It's called not being an oh, idiot. All right. <laughs> all right. Well, we clearly uh, doubled down on that one. He had some Cartoon Network to the second question about Batman. <laughs> oh, it's like 66. Yeah. yeah. Uh, everybody else going to take a quick break. I'm going to take a permanent one. I'm going to go kill myself. We'll be right back. <laughs>